I am a great fan of hard rods, stainless steel, dry grits and accumulated several different ones over the years. Recently I saw the u stainless steel grit at one of the outdoor retailers. It looked interesting and I decided to add it to my collection. This video shows my first attempt to use this flexible grit. Today we do not have a specific braai master so everyone can help, ask questions and offer advice. We got going in this newly built outdoor braai area. The fire needs to outlast all the different dishes that we will test on the grid. Glasses with refreshing drinks are part of a braai and it gives us time to have a close up look at the u braai. With its unique U-stand, this grid can be adjusted to any height and any angle, all with just one hand, horizontal and vertical. The u is patented as clearly indicated on the packaging. There are instructions included in the packaging to explain how to do this, so let's give it a try. Not too bad for the first time. The fire is nearly ready. Let's test our maneuvers a last time before putting our first dish, lamb ribs, onto the grid. The U-stand is placed in the fire bed at a position to ensure the heat will be distributed equally over the total grid area. The grid is carefully placed onto the U-stand through an eyelet and then released to stay in position at a specific height. The coals are hot so we use protective gloves to rotate the grid. Careful. Here we illustrate the different angles the grid can use to get exposed to heat from the sides. Maybe we should have put the U-stand a bit deeper into the ashes, but it still supports the weight of the grid with the meat. Ok, we use two hands, but you get the idea. Onto our next dish, lazy aged ribeye steak. Same procedure, but this time we use the horizontal position for the grid and rotate it 180 degrees. With more practice, I am confident we will manage to use only one hand to do this. Finally, a few sandwiches to be toasted on the last heat of our fire. We select an appropriate height, rotate it once or twice. And wow, that looks delicious. The food is ready, time to enjoy. You don't need other gadgets to use the hot rods u -Bry. It can support itself, the height and angle can be adjusted and it can be set for thick or thin content. It is easy to clean afterwards and can be packed away neatly into a small package. <laughs> 